Before this place was Funky Monkey, there was a man on the roster. There was a man by the name of Honey Badger, the Honey Badger. He had like two or three matches. And then one day, Funky Monkey said, Tom Hitler, you're not good enough to be in the Funky Monkey roster. They, sure they said, Tom Hitler, you're not good enough to hang with the superstars of Funky Monkey Wrestling. And I saw a Tom Hitler with his head down, a broken man by the name of Tom Hitler. And I found him, and I told him, if you want Funky Monkey to do what you want, you can't be Tom Hitler anymore. Tom Hitler is dead to Funky Monkey. You need to be something else. You need to be somebody that they're not even going to pay attention to. Someone so low on their radar that he's not going to mean anything to them. No one. And Fat Stanley was born. So Tom Hedler stuck around. Tom Hedler paid his dues. Tom Hedler helped set up the ring. Tom Hitler helped out whenever he could. And meanwhile, Fat Stanley stayed under the radar. Well. Fat Stanley did what I want. And then Tom Hitler paid his dues. Tom Hitler did what they wanted. He was an obedient employee. And you know what Funky Monkey does with obedient employees? They reward them. They reward them with things like general manager. GM Tom Hitler. You see, I said I would do anything to have this belt. And I meant everything. Blood, sweat, tears, espionage. I did it all. And Matt Cage can say whatever he wants about being the champion. He can say that he'll do whatever he wants, but it's not enough. Because I did it and more. Matt Cage can have tonight. Matt Cage can have this wonderful season finale of Champion's Choice because I have Funky Monkey for the rest of my God-given life. As long as this man's in charge, which is for the foreseeable future, it's my company and this is my belt. Funky Monkey is not Funky Money. It's Nasty Monkey. Yeah. <laughs>